Hey, welcome to the Gypsy Food Network. Tonight we're going to make the basic pie crust. Everybody's been asking about it every time I make something and they can't find it on there. So we're going to renew the thing here. What you need is two cups of flour, uh, a teaspoon of salt, eight tablespoons of uh, shortening, and one stick of butter. Okay? Put them all in one bowl and what we're going to do is we're going to just start to mash this together into the flour. And we're going to make it like... Uh, all mixed up is going to, they say it was supposed to look like cornmeal, but it don't. But I'll be back with you guys in a little bit and show you guys how it looks. Okay guys, we're back. Now it's, it's not even done yet. But you can still see the flour over here, even though this is uh, looking like this. But what you do is you keep on tossing it like this and keep on mashing it, okay? Until we get it all incorporated. You can move your bowl around. And once we get it all incorporated, I'll come back and I'll add the water and I'll show you guys the next step. Hey guys, I'm back. Now there's no more dried flour in there because I incorporated it. And yes, it's going to look like this lumpy, which is okay. I, I have no problem with it every time I make my crust. So this is going to be a two pie crust, two cups of uh, flour, table, uh, teaspoon of salt, eight tablespoons of um, shortening, and one stick of butter and a quarter cup of ice water okay they say to pour it one teaspoon at a time but you know what there's no need and then just keep tossing it with your fork like so and it's going to come together okay it's going to gobble all up and we're going to make the ball with it so that there's no problem here and then i'll be right back hey guys Okay, after I tossed it with the fork, it started forming a ball, so I got my hands and formed it up into a ball like so, okay? And it, now at this point here, you can wrap it up in plastic, uh, wrap, put it in the refrigerator, do whatever you want, and then take it out later, and uh, cut it in half, and form it into a little ball, and place it on the, um, on the board, and start making your pie crust, your first circle. And then the second circle, after you're done with that one. You guys all know how to make the pie. And then the, this, at this point also, you can freeze it and keep it. And whenever you want a pie crust, you already have it. You can even make it in your pie tin and put your plastic wrap on it and leave it in the refrigerator whenever you guys are ready. Okay, guys, I'm using mine right now, so we'll check you guys out next time. God bless all the subscribers, all the friends. Thank you for stopping in, and I hope this helped those guys who's been wanting the pie crust and couldn't find hey it. Hey guys, I'm back. <laughs> um, someone on the page said that you have to refrigerate it for a half hour, uh, the, the flour and everything else. You know what? You don't really have to. You can use it right as soon as you get done. That's why we put ice water in there, uh, so that we can go ahead and use it and get the butter and the shortening cold enough for us to spread it. Okay guys, we'll check you out next time.